Our first guest is a very talented actress who stars in the new movie The Lost Daughter, which is in select theaters Friday and streaming on Netflix December 31st. Please welcome Dakota Johnson! Ah, oh, yes, I'm talking about. Ah, oh, I miss you. It's always great to see you. I miss you too. This is so sad. I mean, it's great. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, yeah, it's sad, yeah, but I wish, yeah, I, w I wish you were here, but yeah, uh, are, are, you're doing well? I'm good, yeah. Good. I'm good. Uh, How are you doing? <laughs> I'm doing good. I'm so much bigger than you, I can see what I look like next to you. No, I like on, the size of you. So I, weird. We always want more of you, so now we just made you actually physically bigger now, yeah, we love it. <laughs> more, more Dakota Johnson, the better, that's what I say. Uh, I have to talk about this because last time we were, we were on the show, you were very funny. We we're talking about this uh, this article you did for uh, or photo shoot spread you did for Architectural Digest or something of your home, and there was a bowl of limes in the kitchen. Some people know what I'm talking about. And and, and in the article you said like, oh yeah, I, I love limes or something like that. And then you 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 came on our show. You said actually you don't love what well, you, you said you're allergic to limes. And it caused a yeah. giant controversy. I mean, this was the, this could have been the end of your career. There was, people wrote articles. Look at this. Dakota Johnson lied to us about loving limes. <laughs> and this is major headlines. This is uh, Dakota Johnson uh, selling her house and confessing she hates limes is the biggest plot twist of 2021. Wow. Feels like there was way more important news than that. Are you aware of the fallout? I mean, how are you dealing with this crisis? <laughs> Well, it's been really hard, Jimmy. Um, <laughs> do, you, do you not love I, limes? I I don't really care about limes. I love them, <laughs> and I and I also found out after I did Arc Digest, I did that, and I'll, and you know they they have somebody who's super talented come in and um, make your house look amazing. Yeah. So they put this big bowl of limes, which I saw while we were filming, and it was funny. So I talked about it. Because who has a bowl of only limes? <laughs> Apparently me. Apparently and then, um, yeah. then I did an allergy test a few weeks later and turns out that I'm allergic to limes. But I never knew because usually when I have them, they're in like a tequila. So. <laughs> yeah, that, that kind of, yeah, that tastes. Is there anything else you're allergic to just so we can get out of the way now for no more controversy? Yes, thank you so much for asking. Wow. <laughs> I'm so excited to have this be in the news too. Um, <laughs> I'm allergic to soy. There you go. Wow. So. Yeah, there you go. There you go. The, don't the reaction. Don't send me any edamame this Christmas season. <laughs> yeah, we're not going to get you any edamame. Uh, what are you doing for the holidays? You have any plans? I'm going to be um, at home with my family. Oh. Some of my family is coming to my house. Oh, are you? Uh, so you're hosting the whole family. Is that stressful? Um. I haven't really thought about it. It's fast approaching, isn't it? Yeah, it's like next week. Yeah, you really have to, yeah. You have to plan something. No, I don't. <laughs> you have to get like food, you have to do something, you have to entertain, what do you, you gotta play games? Do you play board games? Yeah, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Games for sure, we'll do like Scrabble and all the, you know, oh, the games. But like, I, I feel like it's better and more relaxing for everybody if they just fend for themselves. <laughs> Wait, but what? <laughs> Wait, so your parents come and you go, yeah, look, if you're hungry, you're an adult. Get something. Exactly. They're all grown-ups. <laughs> uh, what's your go-to Scrabble word? Do you have one? I have a great one Does for anyone you. have a go-to Scrabble word? Oh, yeah. Oh, I definitely have mine. That's impossible. No, I'll tell it to you and it'll be yours. What is it? Za. Oh, like the short for pizza? Yeah, I, pizza's too long of a za? word. Pizza's too long of a word for me to say. So I call it za. <laughs> but it's, it's in the Scrabble dictionary. Za is a real word. It is, it is. Changes the whole game. Isn't, so, so is J, J, A? J, O, J, O. Q, A. Q, A? Mm -hmm. I, I'm gonna challenge you on that one. I'm really good at Scrabble. <laughs> we'll play next time you come on. Uh, are you okay. going to watch any holiday movies? I really love, okay, my whole life. Well, no, not my whole life. That's intense. But when I was little, I went through a phase where I watched Home Alone 
every day um, of the year. <laughs> every single day you watch Home Alone? Every day. Wow. I was really into it. I was like that with uh, Pee Wee's Big Adventure. I watched it every single day, <laughs> memorized every line, used to do impersonations of everybody. I loved it so much. I mean, yeah. if I quizzed you on Home Alone, you think you'd do well? I think maybe, I don't know, maybe, let's try. I have do you some have questions? a question? I do. Oh, okay. <laughs> Can you say Sorry. that? On, can you say that on TV? No, you can't. Oh, shoot. Thank you. Uh, That's what I meant. All right, ready for this? What are the yeah. bur what are the burglars' first names? Harry and Marv. Wow, that is correct. Hey, I thought that was a hard one. That's the easy oh, one for really? you. Okay. Um, okay, come on. All right. What did the burglars <laughs> What did the burglars refer to themselves as in the first Home Alone movie? What do they call um, themselves? Um, the Wet Bandits. Wow, this is unbelievable. That's correct. They... Why, why? They leave the bathtubs running. They leave the water running in the houses. Um, wow, that's, that's right. Their, that's their calling card. Wow, this is ex This is fantastic. You know, all right. How about this is a tough one. What is the name of the movie that Kevin watches while eating ice cream? Oh, um, it's not a real movie. It's um, it's a fake movie. It's called um, Angels something. Oh, Angels. Yes. Dirty Angels? So, dirty, Dirty Angels? No, something like that. <laughs> dirty, Dirty Angels, but very close. Angels with Filthy Souls. Oh, same thing. <laughs> yeah, oh, we gave you credit for that? <laughs> we gave you credit for it. The judges cool. like you here. Um, uh, okay, what character does Macaulay Culkin's brother, Kieran Culkin, play? Um, um, Fuller, because, and, and he wets the bed. <laughs> Wow. Is that right? That is correct. <laughs> Fuller's, that's right. Uh, okay, uh, this, let me see if we can... Can I me. tell you something quickly, just like as a, just like a, a intermission from the game? Yeah. I saw Macaulay Culkin recently, and I've never seen him in real life, but I saw him because he was walking in the Gucci show. Was he really? And I, I was shocked. <laughs> <laughs> you made that word three syllables. <laughs> Shocked. <laughs> wow. I, um, because because you're I, such a fan. Well, logically, like I know that he's grown up, you know. But then when you see him, <laughs> he's a man, and he was a man wearing Gucci clothes, <laughs> just walking down Hollywood Boulevard. Yeah, he is a he is a man. Yeah, it's unbelievable. Uh, can we talk about your new movie? Uh, let's let's so do that. Let's we're do that. not going to finish the game because <laughs> I was going to win. I, I feel like it's too easy. You're getting all of them right. I mean, you're clearly a fan. I mean, I, I'll <laughs> ask you one last one. Ready? What gift does the fake Santa Claus give Kevin? Oh, um, Tic Tacs. Wow. That was unbelievable. You're amazing. You're a fan. God. You're amazing. You really are a fan. I love that. Uh, <laughs> next time you come on, you can ask me questions about uh, Pee Wee's Big Adventure. Um, okay. I want to talk about your new movie, The Lost Daughter. Um, uh, congrats, by the way. Uh, today you got uh, two Golden Globe nominations, so that's always good to get <laughs> two Critics' Choice Award noms. Nom 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 nom. Uh, this is major. Nom nom nom. Yeah, nom nom nom. Uh, uh, tell everyone <laughs> what what it's about. Can you explain the movie? Um, the Lost Daughter is a movie based on the book by Elena Ferrante, and it is about a woman um, who is vacationing on a beach and she becomes sort of obsessed with this young mother and her daughter who seem to be having a troubling time. The young woman is kind of struggling with difficult things in her life. Yeah. And I play that person, her name is Nina. Um, and it's with Olivia Coleman and Jesse Buckley and wow. loads of other supremely talented people and Maggie Gyllenhaal directed it and it is um, pretty intense. <laughs> yeah, congrats on being in such an awesome film. I want to... Uh, Thank you. Well deserved, buddy. I, I want to show everyone a clip. Here's Dakota Johnson in The Lost Daughter. Take a look at this. So she's not calming down. Yeah. It's been a weird day. 
we found her and then she lost her doll. I used to have a doll like that, called Mina. Mina? Mina. Or Mini Mama, as my mother called her. You'll find it. Dakota Johnson, everybody. The Lost Daughter is in select theaters Friday and streaming on Netflix December 31st. Hey, hey.